Hey guys! Today we are making this absolutely delicious salmon. It's super quick in the oven and it's unbelievably juicy. But if you're thinking, salmon's too expensive for me, then you clicked on the right video because I'm gonna share my secret on how to save so much money! This was all I had in my wallet. Chef Steph. Oh! All right, so I eat salmon at least two times a week, and it's not because I'm rich. Remember? So I'm gonna share with you the best kept secret. Come closer. Come on. Ah uh, ah uh, ah. Uh. Let's start marinating our salmon, and then I'll tell you the secret. I promise. In a small bowl, add a quarter of a cup of lemon juice. If you have a zester, feel free to add some shreds of lemon zest. Add two tablespoons of olive oil, two teaspoons of fresh rosemary, and a half a teaspoon of sea salt and a half a teaspoon of pepper. Here I have my four beautiful fillets and I'm just taking out some of the moisture by patting them dry. Pour a little more than half of your mixture in a shallow dish and set aside the other half for later. I like to avoid marinating in bags to be a little more eco-friendly. Now add your fillets. Make sure each one is well coated. Cover with saran wrap and place in your fridge for at least 30 minutes. All right, here's the secret. When most people decide to splurge and have salmon for dinner, they run to the grocery store. Big mistake. Avoid the grocery and go to a wholesale club. I buy a huge piece of salmon, huge, for about $21. While it's more money up front, I end up saving big. Bigger than the 20 that's in my wallet. I cut that one really big piece into seven to eight single serving fillets, and then I individually wrap them up in saran wrap and put them in the freezer. That means anytime I want a fancy salmon dinner, it defrosts like that and it costs me less than three dollars. Three dollars! Set your oven to 400 degrees. Prepare a baking tray with a sheet of tin foil. Place the salmon on your tray. Mmm, look at that. If you have some marinade left over, be sure to put it on the salmon. These will take about five to seven minutes in the oven. If you have bigger pieces than this, they may take up to 12. You'll know when they're ready when you can easily flake them apart with a fork. These look and smell incredible. Before you serve, drizzle on the other half of the mixture that we set aside earlier. And don't forget to garnish with some sprigs of rosemary. Since you watched this video and must like fish, I mean, you do, don't you? Then I'll leave you with some of my other fish recipes. Healthy, delicious, and low budget. If you enjoyed today's video, don't forget to give me a thumbs up and leave a comment below and let me know what you thought or if you have any recipe requests. Have a great week and as always, keep it classy. That baby.